Welcome to Telephone Training for the NEC SV9100 and DT Series phones. Today we will discuss the physical features of the phone, call handling, which will include placing internal and external calls, putting calls on hold, transferring, and conferencing. Let's take a tour of the 24 button phone as we discuss some of the features. The phone has three different height settings and adjusts via the back brace. At the top of the phone display, you will notice a light indicator. This will flash for incoming calls and if you have a new voicemail. The display also adjusts up and down. In the display, you will have your date, time, extension number, and caller ID which is presented during a call. Soft keys are the feature buttons that appear in the bottom of your display and correspond with the four gray buttons below. The features adapt to the changing state of your phone. For example, when the phone is idle, the soft keys listed are list, directory, voice message, and a down arrow which accesses more features on the first two soft keys. ICM and program. To exit any screen, you may press the exit button located here or simply lift and replace the handset. List soft key gives you the option to redial, which you can access down here as well, and CID, which accesses the caller ID for the last 50 incoming calls. If you notice in the top left hand corner, there is a handset with an arrow above. This indicates a missed call. To view the caller ID for the missed call, you press the CID soft key, use the scroll up and down arrows. The missed call is indicated with an asterisk. Directory soft key accesses the program system wide speed dials or ABB, extension list, station speed dials, and telephone book. Voice message soft key accesses the voicemail platform which we will go over later. If you lift the handset, the soft key features change to voice message, internal page and external page. These paging features can be easily accessed on your DSS OneTouch keys which we will go over in a bit. When you are on a call, your soft key features change as well. They are conference, repeat redial, save, which saves the number, and transfer. Next, we have the 24 programmable keys. These keys can offer you features, extensions, speed dials, and line appearances. To see what is programmed on each key, you can first press the help button located top right, followed by the individual key. Moving down, we have our fixed feature section. Along our dial pad, we have recall, feature, answer, mic, menu, our function scroll buttons, speaker, transfer, and hold. Recall provides dial tone while connected to an outside line. Feature is used occasionally to access telephony feature setups. The answer button allows you to answer external calls that are ringing on your phone. The first call will be put on hold automatically. Mic button allows you to turn your mic on and off. If the mic button is not lit or is flashing, that indicates that mute is on. If the mic button is solid, mute is off. Menu provides access to other phone settings such as ringer volume, off-hook ringing, and backlight options. Scroll buttons allow you to adjust volume control 
for handsets, speaker, ringing, and also adjust the brightness of your LCD display. Left also provides access to the redial function and right to the directory. Press the center button for enter. Speaker gives you hands-free capability. Transfer allows you to transfer to another extension, voicemail, or outside line, and hold will put internal or external calls on hold. Now we will discuss call handling. To place an outside call, lift the handset or press speaker button. Dial 9 plus the 10 digit number you wish to call. To place an internal call, Lift the handset or speaker button, dial the extension number or DSS1 touch key if programmed. To answer an incoming call, you can identify the caller ID information on the display. Lift the handset or press the speaker button to be connected. To place a call on hold, with the call in progress, press the hold key. The line key will flash. To retrieve the call, press the flashing line key. To transfer a call internally, press the transfer button or the transfer soft key. Dial the extension. For a blind transfer, simply hang up or stay on the line to announce the call. To complete the transfer, you hang up. To transfer a call directly to voicemail, press the transfer button or transfer soft key. Press the voice message soft key. Dial the extension number and hang up. To transfer a call off-site to another number, press the transfer button or the transfer soft key. Dial 9 plus the 10-digit number. Announce the call and hang up to complete the transfer. Please note, the phone system will use two lines for the duration of the external transferred call. This can be an issue for systems with limited phone lines, also known as trunks. To set up a conference call, Place your first call, press the conference soft key, the original call is placed on hold, dial the extension or external number of the party you'd like to conference in, press the add soft key when the party answers or release to end the second call. If you want to add another party, you may dial them in now, or press the Begin soft key to join all parties to the conference. Up to 16 parties can participate depending on your phone configuration. Let's go over some button programming on the standard 12-button phone. To place your extension in Do Not Disturb, Press the DND button, followed by 1, 2, or 3. 1 blocks external calls only, 2 blocks internal calls only, and 3 blocks all calls. If you do not choose 1, 2, or 3, it will default to Do Not Disturb All after 30 seconds. The DND key will stay lit while in Do Not Disturb mode, and the mode is indicated in the display. To cancel Do Not Disturb, press the Do Not Disturb button and zero. To make an announcement over the speaker of the telephone or all call page, lift the handset, press the page button, wait for the tone, make your announcement,
to make an announcement over the speaker of the telephone or all call page, lift the handset, press the page button, wait for the tone, make your announcement, and use the hook switch to hang up quietly. To dial a number from your directory, press the directory soft key followed by type or press the directory scroll button for system speed dials. Scroll until you find the desired number. Lift the handset or speaker to place the call. To redial a call, press redial. To redial the last number, press pound or scroll to the desired number. Lift the handset and place the call.